What's going on everyone? I'm back here with another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to reformat a, an external hard drive in Windows 8 slash 8.1. Um, I've actually gotten a few requests for this particular video so with that being said let's go ahead and get started. <clears throat> uh, what you're going to need uh, to do this is of course your hard drive that you want to reformat. Um, I'm going to be using a 320 gigabyte hard drive inside the two and a half inch Oracle uh, hard drive enclosure and you can pick this enclosure up off of Amazon for relatively cheap and it's actually a really nice enclosure for the price um, and also you're going to need your uh, USB cable uh, that comes with the enclosure so um, with that being said let's go ahead and start with this now so what you need to do from here is simply plug in your USB cable to connect the external hard drive to your computer. And the computer I'm going to be using for this demonstration is a laptop. It is not a desktop, for those wondering. So uh, once you have the hard drive connected, uh, from here we can now move up onto the display. All right, from here, uh, you guys need to now open up Control Panel. And to do that, you simply just go to the side menu, click Settings, and click Control Panel. And from in here, you need to click System and Security. And then at the very bottom, you want to click on Administrative Tools. And then within here, you need to click on Computer Management, and then this window should appear. And within this menu, uh, you can now click on Disk Management under the Storage section here. So we click on that. And now you have a list of all of the hard drives and disks that you currently have connected to your computer. So the hard drive that I have currently connected is disk 1 right here. So if I click on it, uh, it doesn't really give you anything until we give it a command. But the way you format it is you need to, uh, if you have a touch screen uh, such as this computer here, you need to uh, click and hold on the hard drive. Or if you're using a mouse and keyboard or uh, you need to right click on it and it'll give you the same menu. So once you have the menu open you need to click the format option and then from here uh, you need to choose some settings Let me zoom in slightly um, that you can choose uh, to format the hard drive. Now I'm not going to actually format this particular hard drive uh, because I actually have sensitive data on it um, but Yes, from here you can uh, adjust the name of the hard drive, so you can change the name, uh, and you can choose the file system. Uh, since we're on Windows, it is only giving us the NTFS option, and then you can allocate the size of the uh, drive as well from default, and then you have all these other options that you can choose from. And then you can do a perform a quick format, which essentially just quickly uh, reformats the drive and gets it into a working state. Uh, very fast without any um, uh, a long amount of time. <clears throat> uh, if you uncheck that option, it will go through a longer process and basically securely delete uh, the data that is currently on that drive. And then you have enable file and folder compression, which that just kind of saves space. Uh, and you only really need to do that if it's necessary, but for most of the time, it's not really a necessary thing to do. Um, and then once you have chosen all of the settings and uh, picked a name for your drive and everything like that, uh, you can then hit OK, and then the computer will then go through the process of reformatting that drive uh, to a clean state. So that is how you reformat a hard, an external hard drive use, um, in Windows 8 slash 8.1. Now, like I said, this should work in Windows 7 as well as Windows 10 operating systems. So it shouldn't be any different. Now, of course, Windows 7 does not have the slide over menu as it does in Windows 8 and 10. So um, just access your control panel as you normally would in Windows 7 and then continue with the steps as I showed earlier. So anyway, that is how you reform a hard drive. Um, hope this uh, video helped you guys out. Uh, make sure to hit the subscribe button right down there. It helps out much. And if you guys like the video, hit that like button as well. It's greatly appreciated. And if you guys need help or have any questions or comments or anything like that, leave us a comment in the section below. 
and I will get back to them as soon as I can. So yeah, once again, hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.